Hey drone friends, this is Adam at UAV Coach and Drone Pilot Ground School. Happy Friday morning and welcome to our Drone Weekly News Roundup. Before we get started, I wanted to let you know about this awesome drone racing event that's happening in Miami at the end of the month. The Drone Racing League is hosting a championship event, Miami 3.0 Fly, at Lone Depot Park on February 25th, 2023. The event will feature custom racing drones flying through a neon-colored aerial course at 90 miles per hour. They are offering free tickets to our viewers, so click down below and grab them now to experience the thrill of high-speed drone racing. With that said, I have three stories to share with you this week. Our first story covers all of the top drone events that we're excited about for 2023. They include the Drone Racing League's Miami 3.0 Fly, which we just covered. It is on February 25th in Miami, Florida, and you can get free tickets down below. The Drone Soccer National Championship, which is April 16th in Utica, New York. The La Tech Connect on May 8th in Denver, Colorado. The AUVSI Exponential 2023 event, which is May 8th through the 11th in Denver, Colorado. The Energy Drones and Robotics Coalition Annual Summit, which is June 12th through the 14th in Houston, Tennessee. And the Commercial UAV Expo, which is through September 5th through the 7th in Las Vegas, Nevada. Our next story involves Flyhound a cutting edge drone technology startup that looks to revolutionize the way people are found when they go missing. The company's module, which for now only works with DJI drones, utilizes radio signals to locate lost individuals. The module is capable of finding a missing person within a remarkable 30 minutes or less. It does this by triangulating cell signals from the phones of people lost in the wilderness, as well as those who may be disoriented and lost in an urban environment. It was also a part of the NECX startup incubator program. And with its revolutionary technology, the company is hopeful about making a significant difference in the safety of individuals. And finally, if you've ever been annoyed at how loud your drone is or always afraid of the possible glances and stares whenever you fly your drone, MIT has you covered. Researchers there have designed a new type of propeller to make drones quieter. By using a toroidal propeller shape, the design allows a drone to operate much more quietly compared to a drone using a typical propeller design. The researchers also state that the new design has even more benefits attached, like reducing the chances that the spinning propeller will cut, catch, or clip objects or surfaces in the drone's path. And to me, that sounds like a win, win, and a win, and I am all for it. And before we wrap up, I have some photos and videos to share. Thank you again to all of the people that submitted photos and videos last week. Here are just a few we picked, but we wanna keep doing this every week, so please keep the submissions coming. All right, that's all we have for this week. As always, check out the links below to read more about each story. Also, show us some love by subscribing to our YouTube channel and liking this video. And now, I'll pass it off to you. Which drone events are you excited about this year, and what do you think about drones becoming quieter? Personally, for me, I love it. Comment down below, I'd love to hear your thoughts. I hope you all have a great weekend, and to all of our drone pilots out there, blue skies and safe flying.